Good morning, everybody. I slept so good last night. I mean, <clears throat> I hit the rack. I didn't get up once. Slept about eight hours. So, it was one of the best nights sleep I've had in a long time. So, just uh, moving about this morning and uh, about to use the facilities here on the Superior Hiking Trail. It's a glorious morning. <clears throat> All right, good morning again. We just left camp. Destination this morning is Dyers Creek or Frindenburg campsites. Uh, we it's it's probably about 9:30. We just kind of messed around camp this morning. We not a lot of miles to do, obviously, so uh, we weren't rushed to to pack up and leave. Uh, we're not real sure which you know which one of those campsites we're going to go to because you know it's it's Saturday. So we don't know if they're going to be full or or what. So we're just going to check them out. So it'll be either. I think uh, Dyer's Creek is eight miles and Frienderberg is ten, or it might be vice versa. I'm not sure. But uh, weather's not as great as it was yesterday. It's a little bit overcast. I think we got like a forty percent chance of rain today. I'm hoping hoping we don't get any. All right. <coughs> Cabrew Bridge. Alright, off to my right, I don't know if you can see that, Lake Superior, that's our view this morning, we've been skirting this Ooh. for a little bit this morning, it's just now starting to drizzle, so hopefully it'll pass, hopefully I won't have to break out the rain gear, but beautiful hike this morning, beautiful weather, other than the rain, I mean temperature wise, just beautiful, love it. Great day to be on the Superior Hiking Trail. Hey, still on the trail. Um, I've dropped back from the group. Really like my alone time sometime. You know, speaking of that, if if you're new to backpacking or you're a little ap apprehensive about, you know, coming out by yourself, you know, I highly recommend don't play the what if game. What if I get attacked by a bear? What if I get bit by a snake? What if, if I get raped or pillaged? I just say raped. I don't know who would want to rape me, but you get me. Uh, mail them to them. They'll repair them, I think. Will they? Yeah. Oh, nice. I'd at least ask them about it. What pond is this? This is Alfred's pond. I have no clue why they call it Alfred's Pond. I tried to look it up on the internet and ask the Spirit Hiking Trail people and... Nobody knows, huh? Nobody knows. <clears throat> Alright, we uh, made it into camp. We're at the Dyers... Is it Dyers Creek campsite? Yes, sir. Dyers Creek campsite. Um, we only uh, figured we'd 
chance it here instead of going to the other one we were pretty sure that the other campsite down there what was the next one i have no idea uh, anyway the next campsite down yeah. the the next campsite down we were worried about it being filled up so we this one was empty so we took it so that just means we got to hike an extra two miles tomorrow no big deal um one of our party is pretty tuckered out right now uh she's had a pretty hard day hadn't you sadie she's got her hips pointed at the fire right yeah. now she is not dead i promise you she's just tired so uh yeah we're gonna mess around here tonight um i had a trail side bean and cheese for lunch and uh, we got us a nice little fire going what do you call this fire Joe? I call it the Swedish candle. Swedish candle fire. I didn't uh, it. Uh, yeah last night we had the upside down fire this one seems to be working better than the upside down fire. Yeah we don't have the ability to split those logs. So. Yeah we hadn't set up camp yet but uh, that's next it's kind of been spitting on us intermittently today so I think we're just kind of waiting to make sure the rain's gone out before we set up. At least I am, anyway. My gear set up later? Yeah, I'm gonna re do some uh, gear review setups in a little while. So uh, see you then. All right, I guess I'll uh, give you all the tour of our homes. So I'm going with the uh, H&O shelter. You all have seen that. I think the all-in-one sock tarp and a hammock all in one suspension really loving that thing right now so that's what's on top on the bottom i've got a, a darien okay from uh, dream hammock randy from dream hammock made this for me it's custom i sent him this 1.55 multi-cam epsilon material and uh, he added the uh light, the green uber lightweight um, mosquito netting number three zipper um, continuous loops actually are attached to these hammock anchors and what I've done is I've run the um, amp seal to itself on the loop so and that way it stays on the anchor I've actually gotten in one of these before and it's popped off and uh, sitting on the ground so it's all in one suspension if you tool up here at to the top I'm always messing with my suspension to do new things but Went back to just the simplest thing on the planet, which is bungee cord, one of those little Dutch um, beaners used for uh, you know ridge lines or whatnot, and a prussic. All right, so we're still here on the Superior Hiking Trail, and tonight we're going to be reviewing the uh, Heather's Choice smoked sockeye salmon chowder. Mm. I'm really excited about this. I think it's going to be delicious. But you're going to find out whether it is or it isn't. It jacks that blue packaging really makes your eyes pop. Does it? Does it make my, my eyes pop? Beautiful. All right, here we go. We are uh, fairly rehydrated. Smells good. So my rating would 